guys, welcome to my channel. Verse of the day, therefore the Lord will wait that he may be gracious to you, and therefore he will be exalted that he may have mercy on you. For the Lord is a God of justice. Blessed are all those who wait for him. Isaiah 30, 15 through 18. Prayer, dearest Abba Yahweh, thank you for this day. Thank you for your faithfulness in my life. Thank you for your promise to bless and multiply me. Direct my steps. Keep me close to you as I increase in you. Father, I choose to press forward and keep believing for the dreams and desires you've placed in my heart. I trust you today with everything that I am. Help me, dear Lord, to live today as if I were of an inestimable worth to you. May I have confidence in your presence and protection. Thank you for how much you value me, even as I value my own eyesight. Thank you for the ways you protect me as a mother bird shelters her young under her wings. Let me remember not only the good things in life, but also the bad. The good helps me to rejoice and the bad helps me to avoid making the same mistakes again. Lord, let me learn from my mistakes. Help me to remember that as a child of God, you are with me at all times. May I be an encouragement to someone today who is alone and feels no one cares. May the joy of Jesus shine out through my words and deeds. May I do what I have promised and abstain from what I have said I would not do. May I be as good as my word in all of my relationships and most of all in my relationship with you. By your grace, may I be faithful to fulfill what I have promised you in every part of life. I pray in your son's precious name, amen. And the Bible promise of the day is that God promises that the dead will be raised again on his second coming. For this we say to you by the word of the Lord, that we who are alive and remain until the coming of the Lord will by no means precede those who are asleep. For the Lord himself will descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of an archangel, and with the trumpet of God, and the dead in Christ will rise first. Then we who are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. And thus we shall always be with the Lord. Therefore comfort one another with these words. First Thessalonians 4 verses 15 through 18. And the prayer quote of the day, watch your motive before God, have no other motive in prayer than to know him. Oswald Chambers. God bless you guys. Have a wonderful day. Keep fighting. Uh, keep fighting the good, the good fight. Keep your faith. Keep your eyes focused on God. Trust him and he will provide everything you need. Thank you guys for listening. Bye-bye.